the years had long become wailing ghosts. Gone, yet mourning what could have been. A life with Isabella. A something special that would have been cosy, hot, sacred and messy. It would have worked. That became clear in retrospect. It had been a chance at a real life, a lifetime ago. If only he had sought love as fervently as his obsession with silencing macabre howls that tore through remote Siberian nights like butchering winds, spattering bloodied gobs and shards of prey. Amid fevered sweats and racking chills, billowy memories of Isabella's sensuous hands soothed him. She could caress away any misery. Illness had nothing on the torment of having chosen the wrong life. Over her, decades ago, on faith alone. She had long become an angel of doubt, warning against a life unlived, in pursuit of fallacy. He couldn't die like this without making things right. That had been his ulterior motive, this final mission. But the engine of redemption was running on empty, and the fumes of dogma had long run out. A lesser man would have succumbed sooner. 